Junior girls 1500 meters is where we would find Lachelle Wilkinson of Princess Margaret leading the rest of the pack by a very long way from the get-go and this girl is full of personality. Here she is during the halfway stage taking some time out to smile for the cameras. Who does that during a grueling race of this distance in the sun? Well, she does, making it look rather easy. See? And a few moments later, she dashes for home. Where is the opposition? She's shutting down the engine now and she brings it home. Hardly a bead of sweat on her brow, collecting 10 points in 5 minutes. 36.40 seconds for Princess Margaret. The boys race had nine competitors in this event with the record being set by Gerard Mason back in 2009. That time being 4.27.48 and the meet record of 4.45.46 by Christopher Lestrade just three seasons ago. But while neither of those records was under threat, Shihab Juman of St. Winifred's was the junior boy who had the final say leading them across the line first ahead of Devontae Hart from Leicester Vaughan. This is the first installment in the junior girls under 13, 100 meters. And that rivalry we saw between St. Michael's School and Queen's College from day one spilled over. That's Natara Goddard getting home first ahead of Taylor Wiggins of QC. The second heat was a much more straightforward result for the Cougars as Samara James in lane three had them all looking at the back of the shirt from early in this race, pulling away with every step until she stepped over the line in 13.33 seconds. First of two in the boys under 13 saw Denari Griffith stepping ahead early, leaving the others to play the catch-up game. None of them was ready for him on this day. The second of two in the under 13 boys. Keep your eyes on the center of the track. Zane Andrew Clark wearing the red like the flash. He got to the front first. Next to him, he saw the green of Lester Vaughan threatening to close fast, but that wasn't happening today. Clark found an extra gear that took him to the finish. Under 15 girls now, and this one sees Jazara Levine of Queens College in lane seven doing all the talking with her shoes. But so too was the athlete from the SMS Cougars. But Levine possessed the greater momentum as she stormed home in 13.14 seconds. However, the faster of the two races came in the second heat featuring Alexis Maskell of Leicester Vaughan. She's in lane number eight to the left of your screen. Gia Greenwich of Courage and Parry also looking good. So too, Jazara Innes of SMS in lane seven. But this race is over when Maskell says it's over in a blistering 12.72 seconds. That will be even faster than some of the boys. Now to the under 15 boys, and this particular race was probably the most competitive in this highlights reel. Certainly one of the closest finishes. It just took a while to find a clear leader as three came home faster than the others. But Rajay Gibbons of Courage and Parry was just the winner in 13.54. And the last race in this package is the second under 15 100 meter final. And just like the one before, it was really, really tight until Josiah Gill from some speed and brought along Denario Thornhill of Lestavon with him for the ride. Gill winning in 11.89 seconds. That's how they ran in their Frank Blackman zone. Sean Green, CBC Sports.